This is Western News based in Oregon. It is a Saturday evening, first week of June. My name is Amin Thu. I am at a Oregon coastline, Western Burma. It is a special program reporting about Mokar Cyclone, powerful cyclone, deadly cyclone, the, one of the biggest cyclones in the first 21st century in Oregon, the first time in 16 years after Nugget Cyclone in Western Burma. I will be reporting about the updated situation about the Northern Oregon. World Food Organization starts supporting more victims some area in Oregon after Thursday. After two weeks, the Mocha is one of the most powerful, deadly tropical cyclones in the North Indian Ocean, which Effect in Myanmar in part of the Bangladesh in May 2023, more than two weeks after the deadly cyclone Mokar hits Myanmar, eight access is still unsure, uncertain. A major food crisis remains a real threat, according to the UN news yesterday's June second. Already before the Mokar hits, the 80 percent of the people in Oregon. The Rakhine, the country west, were living in property and 200,000 are displaced persons. Oh, now, you? at least one of 40 people and hundreds of thousands of domestic animals got killed by the cyclone. Some are still missing communication and power lines still caught in affected area. The over 500 lakes in three townships, Pauto, Retedao, and Punajon, need to be cleaned up before the heavy rain. The local data collected on the ground writer Jolen Roma Time said a resident from the Bauto township said they have to cross the river to get the water after one o'clock it is very dangerous as the tide is high and the wave is high last Thursday WFP World Food Organization was in Moser Islands which has 29 village and according to the local residents and the, some village have received some rice and snack. According to the Oregon Education Network members who is in Seungi village at this afternoon in a Mozart Island said that the village Seungi, a big village, has not been given any support from the government or NGO. Western News have been in touch with several victims, mostly Rathera, a lady in Myan indigenous the ethnic set. Her village in the Mayu Rivers community, northern Rathera, has not received anything yet from the NGO. Local researcher Jo Zan Tui told Western News that he has not seen any INGOs coming in his community, northern Rathera. The Western News asked Jo Zan and he said, Humanitarian needs remain high in this uh, cyclone affected area in northern Redditor Township. We haven't seen any humanitarian assistance from both local and international agency for the cyclone uh, affected community in northern Redditor Township. We just heard that there has been humanitarian assistance in other areas in this township. However, community living uh, Along the Mayu River, especially community from Laoshan Village Track Area, Zidibin Village Track Area, Zhaojian Village Track Area, and Opal Village Track Area, haven't received any humanitarian assistance from both local or international uh, agency. 20 days after the storm, the victims from some area, and especially in rural areas in Mozart Islands, in Rathera, in Zipononjong, and some in Chowto Township, including capital city Saitoe, receiving some rice and wells and water from an NGO. Most of the victims are still waiting for humanitarian aid, especially in the northern Rathera down in Pauto Township. And with over 280 displayed per person in Miao'u and uh, southern Budidan in Ma some part of the Mondo, indigenous people, ethnics are at risk since they don't have a particular people to speak out on the matter of their concern. Over 60% of the communication is still unstable. Western News cannot report detailed information about Oregon. Mr. Mitra, UNDP, warned that the action of the supplying 
the provision of the relief itself was not enough and if the people are unable to plant the food crops within the next few weeks there could be a major food crisis and emerging in the coming month this is a special programs of the western news reporting about more curse cyclone hit region today we share about northern oregon situation the hottest hit and if you want to contact that is our email address Western News at plotunmail.com. Thank you so much for watching. See you again.